welcome to Coast Mad Ian on YouTube. Today I'm at Fort Park Beer Festival, uh, the only event I'm doing this year due to Covid. But yeah, I paid for the Maisies. Um, I've got one at 5.30 and one at 6.30 I think. Um, Roots of Evil and Platform 15, both upcharge attractions this year. I uh, hope it's going to be amazing. Uh, the uh, actual event starts at 3 p.m. So yeah, get on plenty of rides at the start. But join me throughout the day where I'll get on it loads of rides and off-ride footage. Hope it's going to be a good event this year. Um, didn't think it was going to go ahead this year due to COVID, but I'm glad it has because it looks amazing. Um, they have gone down the route of scare zones this year. So hopefully it's going to be awesome. The actors hopefully are going to be really good today. So yeah, bring it on. Full Park Beer Festival. I just come off of Nemesis Inferno for my first ride. Uh, it was really slow this morning. That uh, B and M needs to warm up. It's still a good ride. Plenty of theming still. Still running really good. Um, jolty in places, but not nothing too much. But yeah, it's still a good, good coaster. Oh Let's <laughs> come off of two successful rides on Stealth. Um, the uh, Intamin launch coaster at the park, um, impressive. Tried one middle, I was in the middle row at the start and uh, the back as well. Uh, yeah, really intense and a really good ride. Um, yeah, I know it'll warm up later when it gets. Just come off of Colossus, the power of 10. Uh, really smooth this morning, um, quite intense actually, um, yeah, really good ride, um, packs a punch, um, yeah, so that's my third coaster done now, out of possible five, so yeah, Colossus was amazing, yeah, nothing really to say really. Uh, just come off of Saw the Ride at Full Park. Uh, yeah, another really smooth ride on Saw. I usually find it really rough. I was sitting in my best seat on it, uh, the left hand seat in the inner seat. Yeah, it was running really well. A bit of jolt, but yeah, I can't complain about it. Having a, a new audio for Full Park Fear Festival this year. Um, they have got new audio around the park and on the rides. Um, Stealth has got new countdown. Um, Saw has got new audio in the queue line, and it's really blasting out there. And Colossus has got new audio as well, so I'm very happy with that. About to experience my first horror maze of this year, uh, Platform 15. Uh, it's come to 5:30 now. And yeah, I just experienced Platform 15 for 2020. Um, a really good race. They have put a lot of effort into it this year. Um, you start off the other way around uh, to the maze this year. Uh, you go through a really long tunnel. And then, yeah, you're greeted with a load of scare actors. And yeah, they are proper scary. Um, jumping out at you. Um, yeah, it's really, really good maze really solid maze and yeah um, worth doing again uh, I have left it in the light it's definitely a um, dark maze hi hi YouTube this area looks really good for um, Scarefest uh, Fear Festival this year um, Alphans in the house. I think they are um, the opposite to the um, Amenity High. High school sucks. And yeah. Okay, everyone. Uh, 
I've just come off of Rumble Rapids and Vortex. Um, yeah, a really good two rides I had on that. Rumble Rapids is pretty good. I met some people. Yeah. What's your name? Subscribe to the channel. What's your name? Coaster Mad Ian. Coaster Mad Ian. Ian. Yeah. Oh, hi. So nice you, Not today. Not today, I'm not. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fortunately, Slam is still standing. Oh, I don't know what's going on with it this year. Um, I don't know if it's coming back. It was the only SNS Squire SWAT in the world um, which was left. There was only two being made. So yeah, it's still standing with the seats still intact. Um, really don't like rides which just stand there. Just get rid of them. But yeah, the Black Mirror Maze uh, Lambra is still opening next year. In, opens in 2021. It was meant to open this year but due to COVID um, it wasn't meant, uh, it's not opening this year, unfortunately. Notice that they changed the audio also for Detonator Bombs Away as well into a feared horror um, sort of voice. So that's pretty cool. Uh, can't wait for this show this year. Uh, it was a really good show last year, Amity High. High school sucks. Um, yeah, it was a really good dark. I uh, have just uh, filmed the Amity High High School Sucks um, uh, show. Absolutely incredible. Uh, the dances were so on point. Um, yeah, the lighting and the both of the groups came together as well to create it more awesome, really. Uh, absolutely amazing. Hello. Post Mad Ian on YouTube. Another ride which is closed for um, the 2020 season is the Walking Dead, the ride. Uh, it's an indoor attraction, an indoor roller coaster. Used to be X No Way Out, and then they changed it to X. And yeah, uh, that's another ride which is also closed due to the COVID. So yeah. They have changed the uh, Darren Brown sign again to roll up, roll up, don't be shy. Yeah, they changed it to the um, beer bar for Oktoberfest. I don't know, actually know what's happening with Darren Brown because all the uh, signposts have all gone um, from, from the uh, posts. So yeah, I know I can understand COVID is in the way due to the experience of the ride and due to the nature of the attraction. But yeah, um, they don't seem to have any um, ride information, which is um, in the area for from Blair Witch. And then we got Creek Freak Unchained, which is um, behind Saw. Platform 15, behind Samurai. So that's the Factory Tunnel, which came back last year. Bloody Cuts, uh, that was a really good film last year. Uh, in the Screenplex Cinema, where the Angry Birds experience is usually held. Terror Amity High, High School Sucks, next to Stealth. That was a really good show last year, plenty of actors and a really good, very good show last year. Uh, and then we got the Lynn to Hope High, Opposite Rush. That's a new one for this year. 
and the Swarm Invasion next to the Swarm, which is a new one. So I can't wait for these scare zones to start at 3 o'clock. And the mystery locations, the crows. So yeah, can't wait for Halloween. Like um, Platform 15 has got a longer tunnel this year and they have put theming around it. Um, yeah, hopefully it's going to be awesome. Yeah. Hi, Coast Mad Ian. Yeah? Yeah. What's your, what's your Coast Mad Ian on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah, um, the areas look really nice for um, Halloween this year, um, Fear Festival. Um, yeah, so I can't wait until 3 o'clock. I've got the Maisie's booked at 5 o'clock. So yeah, Root of Evil and Platform 15. Yeah, this is looking awesome. The uh, new... Wow, this looks like it's a show. Just come off of the swarm, the B&M wing closer, uh, running really well, um, really smooth, not as intense yet, but it will do. Um, yeah, amazing ride on that. Um, it's still my favourite ad. Hi, it's our birthday. Coast to Mad Ian. Can you add me on Instagram, Roots of Evil, uh, a upcharge attraction this year. Um, yeah, a really good maze. It was much better than Blair Witch last year. Uh, a lot more scare actors. It still was a lot of walking like through the woods and that, but it was a lot better maze. Uh, a lot more scare actors. Uh, yeah, they were really good. Um, jumping out at you and that. Platform 15 was better than Roots of Evil. But yeah, it's still a solid maze and still worth the £9 upcharge. Um, yeah. So coming to the end of the day now at full part resort. Um, I'll sum it up when I get back to the dome. But yeah, I'm just going to do a few re-rides in the dark. I've just done Nemesis Inferno in the dark. Uh, a really good ride that is definitely warmed up from this morning. It was really, really slow this morning, but that was flying around the track. Um, really happy that's warmed up. Um, might do, I'm gonna do a night ride on Swarm, night ride on Stealth, and hopefully Saw. And yeah, a really good Fright Nights this year, and I'm really happy with it. Well, it's come to the end of the day at Fort Park Beer Festival 2020. Uh, it's been amazing today. Um, got on plenty of rides. Uh, got on Swarm, the last ride of the day. It was really impressive and really good. Uh, the Maisies, the Scare Maisies were really good uh, this year. Uh, Roots of Evil was uh, really good. Better, better than Blair Witch than last year. Um, Platform 15 was impressive. 
it would have been better in the dark, but that was my fault. Um, yeah, the rides have been really intense today. Um, yeah, and in and all, all the scare zones were really good this year. Um, a really good touch to the park. The actors have been really, really scary today um, and really, really good. Um, can't fault the actors. Um, got plenty of actor footage coming up into this vlog. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the vlog. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment on my videos. Thank you very much for choosing Coaster Mad Ian. Don't forget to check out my TikTok, I Elliot one and my Instagram, ian.elliot330, Coaster Mad Ian. And for the next vlog, I've, uh, this is the last theme park I'm doing this year uh, for 2020. It's been an awesome year, despite the COVID um, has spoiled it a bit. But yeah, it's been an awesome year, the park's what I've been to. Oktoberfest has been amazing at the park this year. Um, yeah, so it's been a really good day today at Full Park Beer Festival. Um, join me in the next vlog, guys, for next year. See you in the next video. Bye.